A Thousand Miles of Rivers and Mountains depicts an ideal world without chaos, just simplicity and virtuousness. Composition-wise, it can be divided into six sections from right to left, and each section is united by detailed images of lakes, boats, bridges, and figures, etc. Rolling mountains, standing tall, farther back in rolling hills or sitting villages, bonding with the undulating rivers, like a fairyland on earth. In the lofty mountains, scattered waterfalls, deep courtyards, pines, and cypresses near the creeks lie within. Thick fog drifts above the mountain peaks from time to time, giving the illusion that the green hills pike into the sky. There are a few boats sailing on the river where a bridge spans over it. Legend has it that this is the exceptional Long Bridge of Sujo, which can be seen from all sides. The mountains extend from near to afar and farther away. There is a waterfall, which is said to be the four-tier waterfall of Mount Lu, with a viewing gallery bridge built on top to display the splendor of these mountains. The painting is filled with harbors, people, fishing boats, cargo ships anchoring on the river. It instills the soul of the market into the quiet and distant mountains. As the mountains rising gradually, the peak in the painting pikes to the sky. The dwellers nestled in the mountains, which adds vast vivid essence to the expansive mountain landscape. Gentle mountains are surrounded by rivers with resting streaks of cottages nearby. Far away is an island with fishermen fence fishing and a fishing spot sitting on its shore, capturing a moment of enthrallment and tranquility. The mountains return to gentle and the mountain voyagers enjoy the beautiful scenery from the lavish green bamboo pavilions and the peaks of the isolated mountain far afield as both the near and far depicts the vivid scenery of the south of the Yangtze River. A Thousand Miles of Rivers and Mountains is not just a painting scroll. It is the epitome of the ideal world of the Song Dynasty literati. In a vast landscape of a prosperous era, a young man in plain clothes hikes towards the quiet mountain. He will not grow old, always remaining 18 years old.